In today's video, I'm gonna show you how you can share your screen on Facebook Live without having to use OBS. Let's go to my page right now and go to under create post. Let's go to live. Okay. And then let's select this tab here that says go live. So since we're not using OBS, Facebook sometimes goes crazy and it keeps bouncing in between your inputs. So if this happens to you, all you have to do just refresh the page. Okay. So let's try actually sharing the screen, but we're going to share whatever is on screen that is going on right now. So let's start screen share and let's choose as you can see you can choose to share a window you can choose to share uh, a chrome tab okay uh, you can choose to share screen one or screen two because right now i have two screens so i'm gonna choose to share screen one and i will share the entire screen okay which is whatever is going on right now and click close and as you can see uh, my screen is being shared right now. Okay, whatever is happening on the screen, that's what's being shared. Okay, and I'm gonna click next, and um, it's asking me to add a title. So I'm gonna say uh, screen sharing. And description, I'm just gonna call it test. Okay. And then I click next and I can, you can actually, uh, actually click hide here just to hide it. So people don't see it and then click go live. So basically this is it. As you can see, uh, we are live right now. If you live streaming uh, like this, uh, you don't have an option to actually add your camera. So that's the downside of it. Okay. That's why I encourage you. If you want to share your screen, the best way really is to use OBS. Uh, but if you cannot use OBS, you just want to live stream your screen, whatever is going on, you can do it this way. The only thing is people are not going to be able to see you talking. So guys, this is how you share your screen using Facebook live. I hope this was helpful. Once you're done, all you have to do, you can end your live video, okay? And then Facebook is going to ask you if you want to save it. Uh, you actually have options here to save it, to delete it, or uh, make some clips out of it, okay? So guys, this is how you do it. If you have questions, let me know. Uh, other than that, if you need to learn how to use OBS or to live stream on Facebook Live using OBS, make sure you check out this playlist uh, that I did about OBS and Facebook Live. Thank you guys for hanging out with me. I appreciate it. Make sure you like this video and subscribe. Other than that, I will see you on my next video. Take care.